What is a magnet? What is a magnet for kids? Do you know what these are? If you said magnets, you are right. Magnets are used in many places for many things and today we are going to learn more about them. So what exactly is a magnet? So magnets are pieces of metal, usually iron or steel, that are able to attract certain kinds of other metals. The force drawing objects to a, a magnet is called magnetism and the area surrounding a magnet is called magnetic field. Pieces of metal like iron or steel can be pulled to a magnet. This is called attraction. When this happens, the metal will stick to the magnet like glue. There are two ends of, on each magnet. Uh, one is called the North Pole and the other is South Pole. Want to know? An interesting fact, the North Pole and, uh, and the South Pole of a magnet are attracted to each other and will always be pulled towards each other. When they are near the the other but the same poles uh, of two different magnets will push apart or repel the other. Let's test this out. First, let's try putting you know, two north poles together. Look at look at that. They are repelling each other. How about two south poles? They are also repelling each other. Now let's try putting a North Pole and a South Pole. Can you guess what is about to happen? You are right, they are sticking together because they are, are attracted to each other. Cool, right? There are three different types of magnets, temporary magnets, permanent magnets, and electromagnets. Temporary magnets become magnetized when a magnetic field is, a, is present and lose their magnetism. When the ma when the field is taking away, uh, like when you rub a magnet against another piece of metal, like a paper clip or a nail, permanent magnets are made uh, from materials like iron or nickel that are naturally or chemically magnetized and already have their own magnetic field, like the magnets you use on your refrigerator. Electromagnets are created by running an electrical current of a coil on a metal core. The energized core creates a magnetic field and when the current is shut off, the magnetic field disappears. An MRI machine is an example of an electromagnet electronics like uh, TV and computers also use this kind of technology magnets are used in many places for many things not just to hang up on your school or work on the refrigerator they are used in speakers computers motors do doorbells telephones compasses and tools they they are also used in doors by rec recycling centers uh, hospitals and lots of, uh, of other places and here is one final interesting fact the earth's core is made out of iron and nickel so it creates its own magnetic field wow magnets are pretty awesome right now that that you know more about magnets let's test your new knowledge how many types of magnets are there three Temporary, permanent, and electromagnetic. Fill the blank. The area surrounding a magnet is called a magnetic blank. Magnetic field, true or false? The Earth, the Earth is core host, hosts own magnetic field. True. What happens when the two south poles? of a magnet or near each other they repel or push apart each other an MRI is an example of a which type of a magnet electromagnet magnificent job magnet reference whether you are doing a science experiment or sticking your 
latest piece of artwork on the fringe. Magnets are all around art. Some points you have probably used a magnet and not even knowing it. But now that you know more about them, you will be able to spot magnets in even the, uh, the most random of places. Hope you had fun learning with us in National Geographic. It was introduced by Maranishan. Bye.